Hello everyone, I'm Captain Logan, and look, it's Freddy. Hi. Hi, Freddy. You wanna play a little Mario Odyssey? Yeah. We're gonna try a little Mario Odyssey here. Now, for some reason, I've lost all my save data on this game. I don't know what happened. One of my kids deleted it or what. I haven't played this in forever. And I've had to rebuy this game twice. Because for some reason, out of the 40 games we have, or, or, or whatever, maybe more than that, this is the one that uh, the kids keep losing the cartridge for. It's it's unfortunate and kind of obnoxious. Uh, but anyway, Freddy is... Actually, I'm sorry, Freddy, can you give me a second here? Yeah. Pardon me, guys. Um... I'm actually going to jump back to the screen for just a second uh, because I got to pop out the chat so that we can see it here. There we go. Okay, so I uh, we are testing my new laptop, and I did a test with this last night with uh, Mario 1 on the NES, and I wanted to do something more graphically intensive and with my ultra-wide monitor, because I've been having some issues with performance on my desktop, and I bought this new laptop that should handle things a lot better than the computer I had before. The homing cap works fine. Okay, but just play. I, I don't need you to test the game, I'm just testing this laptop. Oh. Well, there's the final move that we need. Oh, good. So now we can go to the next... Uh, Okay, the next kingdom. Oh, right, it's not there. Get out of my way. So if you happen to be watching right now, uh, just let me know what the performance is like with this. Uh, we had some crackling going on last night for some reason with the audio, but it was really the only problem we were having. And I wanted to stream some Mario this week because we've got the Mario movie coming out, and I'm very excited about it. Hi, Jonathan. How are you, man? We're just doing a silly, leisurely stream. Fred Freddy has also been begging me to do some game streaming with him lately. We haven't done it in a long time. We should get back to Ghostbusters at some point. Yeah. We did four of those, and I think we got probably halfway through the game. Mm -hmm. Now let's go to the Sand Kingdom. Oh, Bowser's there. I'm also not using my regular mic right now. Jonathan, I, how does it sound? Just let me know if there's any weird crackling happening. And if you can hear the fan when the laptop fan goes, that I'm kind of concerned about that. But anyway, uh, my regular mic I can't plug in right now because I've got the capture card plugged in. And I've only got two USB ports on this thing. And I haven't bought a hub yet that will actually reach where I need to put this laptop. Inside baseball, nobody cares. All right. But Daxi anyway. is taking off to the Sand Kingdom. Oh, boy. There he goes. And I'm also probably going to need something to get another HDMI cable in so that I can put a third monitor up here. Okay, thanks, Jonathan. He says he's not hearing any audio problems yet. Okay. And let me know, know if the sound mix is good, like, if we're being overpowered by music or anything like that. Mutale, how hyped are you for the Mario movie right now? Quite. I'm very, very excited about it. Yeah, it, there's an actual Mario, an actual Luigi, an actual everything. I am watching that movie. <laughs> okay, Jonathan, it makes sense that you can hear a little bit of the fan, uh, but if it's not you know, horribly overpowering. It shouldn't be a big deal when I get back to this mic. I'm just going to keep putting it in front of your face. Okay, that's fine. Because it'll be far enough away from it. It shouldn't be an issue. And you're not experiencing any lag at all, right? No. Oh, this is exciting. This is probably going to be the new production machine. I cannot believe the deal I got on this thing. No, thank on... you. I don't want to go to the action guide. So yeah, I was hoping to kind of jump around some different worlds, but Matali says he can hear the fan, but it's not an issue. Yeah, and, and like I said, this is not the mic I'm usually going to use. So uh, I don't think you'll usually be able to hear it when I get back to my Yeti. So we'll play a little Sand Kingdom here. 
Uh, but yeah, like I, like I was saying a, a minute ago, for some reason, I've lost all my data on this game. But I was wanting to go back through the game anyway, so we'll use this as an excuse to do that. So, Freddy, you said you've beaten this game several times, right? Yeah. And I haven't played it in so long, I'm not going to remember where any of the moons are. Okay. There's a moon. Oh, yeah, the electricity thing shooting across the power lines. I always appreciated that this wasn't a typical Egyptian desert. Like in 64, that they went with more of this kind uh, of oh, Mexican ruins thing. It's pretty cool. I don't want to go through you, Goombas. Uh, these are just small Goombas, so I can't turn into them. But oh, I can I see. turn into other Goombas. The, Jonathan uh, says this, usual brown ones. this game is great, by the way. This game is great. Yeah, I've played it a lot, and I have never gotten tired of it. What is... Well, there's a lot to do in it. What is your favorite 3D Mario game? Is it um, this one? Probably. Okay. It definitely has... You know, is the biggest, most expansive oh. game. And I love the 2D sections. That's one of my favorite things with this game. Yeah. So, Mikey lo My brother Mikey loves the parts where uh, it turns into Mario 1. The only thing I don't like about those is that you can't use the D-pad. That drives me nuts. You should be able to use the D-pad. Are you with me on this? Yeah. You've never thought about it, you don't care? Yeah, I don't... Because you always play with a stick anyway, right? Yeah. Okay, now I just need to get to this one. <gasps> Tom, this is a Lenovo ThinkPad uh, that, I'm, that I'm using, that I'm considering using for my production machine. This is almost the exact same computer that my wife uses for work as an architect. And as soon as I saw it on Facebook Marketplace, at the, especially at the price it was at, I was like, well, considering the graphically intensive stuff that Sarah's got to do for work, this might be perfect. And the guy that was selling it was calling it a, a beast of a gaming laptop. And the specs seemed right. And the kinds of games he was running at 60 frames per second made me think we shouldn't have any trouble. And I'm just excited I may not yeah. have to sell this uh, really cool uh, monitor that I bought. Woo. Hey, can, I, can I do the 2D part? Uh, sure. Also, another fun fact is if you uh, crouch and roll, you can go fast through the pipe. Oh, fun. And it makes a eh, eh, eh sound. An eh, eh, eh sound? Yeah. Oh, the other thing I don't like is that uh, you don't... You don't really run, I don't think, do you? You press Y, you uh, hold Y to run. Is it, does it still run though? Or is yeah. it the exact same speed? I think it's the same speed. I mean, you typically press Y to run in Mario, but I don't. Sorry, I didn't mean to lose your power up, by the way. There was no power up. I haven't played this in so long. Was there not, do you not get small? Yeah, you don't get small. Oh, you, but you lose a lot. You lose a health, yeah. Sorry. Sorry about that. You need that. Look, a moon! Just don't die. It's way over there. You can use a bullet bill to get there. Oh, okay. Wait till one shoots out and then you can... I'm gonna. I'm gonna, son. Or you can just do it. The hard way. You press yell. You press what? Oh. God, it's just been too long. Jonathan Campbell, I prefer Galaxy 2 personally because that's the one I grew up on. And it's funny you say that because, of course, I'm older than you. I uh, And I was already on the channel for a few years when that came out and reviewed it. Uh, and I, I, I love that game. Galaxy 2 is my absolute favorite need a bullet bill. 2D Mario game. I am good at this game. <sighs> You can get these. Ooh, I love this part of the thing that And oh, Freddy, this looks great. 
on this side, on this monitor. Alright. Ow. Okay, some coins. Come on. I'm still blown away by how beautiful this game is. And I gotta tell you, as cool as an Odyssey 2 or something along that line... As cool as an Odyssey 2 or something along those lines would be, I would much prefer a Galaxy 3. And I don't think we'll ever get that, but that, that's, that's what I would most like. You know, a, a Galaxy game that's on this level, that's expansive like this, or this expansive. But at the same time, it is, it is fun to have a lot of different themes where you still have space in there. The moon... Can, can I play? Sure. Uh, the moon is my favorite part. Hmm. With the moon physics. Yeah. Tom, refresh my memory, did you get 3D All-Stars? Yes. We did. I bought it the week it came out because it was limited and, and uh, I wanted to be able to play Galaxy and Mario 64 on Switch on in handheld. Just to be able to take it with us. The, uh, bomb things. Bomb things? Yeah, you have to use the uh, cap to uh, get the blue things to uh, activate the bombs. Yeah, I was just... I forgot that's what that did. I was trying to get to them. But I couldn't remember that they were bombs. Sorry about that. Mm -hmm. I just haven't done this in forever. I'm gonna try again. I'm sorry, man. Mm -hmm. I hate playing games I haven't played in a long time in front of people. I hate playing games in front of people anyway. I don't know why I do game streams. They're fun. <sighs> the nerve wracking. I always suck more when I'm playing on stream. I gotta get better at this. Jonathan! Yeah, the only reason we got Galaxy 2 was because at the time the developers had more ideas and wanted to make a second. We don't tend to get direct sequels to 3D Mario games. No, that's exactly right. And it's funny because when you go back to it, it almost plays like just the rest of that game. You know, as if the first game wasn't already big enough, because it is. There is a lot to do in that. But the amount of stuff to do in this is just absurd. What I always kind of wanted was a 2D Mario game uh, on this level where it, it had, you know, instead of eight worlds, it had some ridiculous number. And I don't think that'll ever happen now given that we have Mario Maker. You fell off too. See, look at that. Ah! Nice dive. I just wanted to dive so it would look cool. It did look cool. It looked very cool. You get the fake moon to get five coins. Oh. Well, I should have done that. I was thinking about it. I was like, is there any incentive to get this? I'm not sure. Mario burns. You like making Mario burn? Well, that's nice. <laughs> Remember back when Mario had fall damage? Yeah, I hated that. I mean, I love Mario 64, but that was probably the one big misstep from that. This one's funny. <laughs> Here, your turn. Oops. And see, now I don't have anything to blame it on either, because we're not having lag issues or anything. The game is playing fine, I just suck. Get that. Get it. It's funny, every time you do that, I'm worried about fall damage. And then I feel stupid because it's not like Galaxy has it. 
I guess I played a little bit of Mario 64 not too long ago. Oh wow, you know this game well enough to almost speedrun it? Jonathan, that's crazy. He says he tried speedrunning it for fun a few years ago, but he said he never did much outside the Cap Kingdom. The movement options are insanely fun. Yeah, you can go real fast through this. With the with the rolls and stuff. Which is funny, I never I I didn't even, I forgot you could do that in midair like that. Which is funny because then in some ways, Freddy, it almost feels like a better, like, 3D Sonic game than 3D Sonic games ever got. You know what I mean? Because it sort of does some of the things you expect 3D Sonic to do. That's cool. And that... And where are the others? Do the cacti hurt you, Freddy? Yes. If you're not careful, they will hurt. I think I can make this jump. What? <laughs> wouldn't let me. But my favorite part is that you died immediately after you said, I think I can make this jump. Mm. Stop running away. I'm not going to hurt you. Not like I'm going to hurt you. Okay, so you just know where those are, so you're not using, like, the glasses? Yeah. Freddy, you nuts, man. I was baffled when you jumped over there. I was like, what is he doing? Hmm. Tony Suarez, we're not using an emulator. We're, uh, we're on our Switch with a capture card. Where's the last one? But hi there, how's it going? Now this last one, I'm pretty sure I don't need the dive there. <sighs> Jonathan, I never really played much Sonic because I didn't play it growing up, but I did play Mania and that was great. Well, if you liked Mania, then you got to go back and play uh, one through Sonic Knuckles. And yes, Mania is just wonderful. Here, help me get these guys. You're faster than me. Speaking of Mania, you know what I bought today? What? And I'm, I'm thinking about having you or Jason give this to the girls for their birthday. Mm -hmm. But I got a uh, stuffed Ray and a stuffed Mighty. Really? Mm hmm Did you know that Ray and Mighty are probably... Give me to grab them. I think I'm, I might have one They're here. friends, and, but I think they're probably brothers because they love each other all the... They are uh, the same them. species. Oh. Oh, you know what? I know I left those upstairs and I didn't think about it. So I can't show you that right now. But. Hmm. Wait. Sheep! 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 Hello, Mr. Cool. I don't know what he means by his favorite PC game. Maybe he's also playing this on an emulator or something. Like Tony Suarez was talking about. Hey! Hey! Go in there! No! Don't run into the cactus! Are you yelling at sheep? Yes! Why are you yelling at sheep? Because they're annoying. And I need to get them to this guy. Oh, Tony, you came in late. We were talking about that earlier, but I'll mention it again. My favorite 3D Mario platformer is Galaxy 2. Where? Bar none. The sheep. I need two more sheep. And this guy will give me a move. And given how gorgeous and expansive this game is and how replayable it is, if there is objectively a best one, it's probably this one. But Mr. Cool, twist sarcasm cap since you said you were testing out your laptop. Uh, I'm testing out my laptop for, I see what you're saying, but but uh, for, for streaming. Of course, I'm using a uh, capture card. Wait. But I'm trying to see if this thing will perform well enough to be my new production machine. Because I was having some performance issues with my desktop. And... I, I did a test last night, and it worked really well, and I wanted no. to up the ante and try it with this uh, ultra-wide monitor yes. that I bought that I couldn't use with my desktop uh, because it was slowing everything down. Get this one in. Ow. Oh, you hit the cactus! And oh, so far, so good. I'm really excited about it. Because I thought I was going to have to sell yeah! this thing. Hello, Braden Atkinson. 
Side-scrolling hero, good to see you. Thanks for popping in for a second. Appreciate you guys. A couple people just coming out of the woodwork that I don't see all the time. Mr. Cool, I don't have a favorite 3D Mario, honestly. Was always more of a Sonic guy. I mean, me too, but I, I love my Marios. Uh, my favorite would probably be Sunshine, though, if you have me at gunpoint. Is that and too obviously, place? not the most popular opinion. It's been too long. What did the thieving monster desire from this land? Well, it's not freezy treats. <laughs> is it? Is it? Is it a ring? Is it maracas? It's maracas, isn't it? Okay. Tony never played Galaxy 2, but loved the first one. I gotta get around to playing the sequel. Yes, you do. It's great. Uh, Yoshi's a lot of fun with that. It's got an awesome final boss. I love it. One who gallops across the sand. How many coins are required to get on its back? Is it 30 or is it 100? Right there. It's a billion coins. And the foreign visitor traveling by car, who's what stopped his journey? Ice, water, sand, or the moon? Or the moon. It's probably not the moon. So, what is it's probably not sand. Oh no! It probably maybe, no. It was it ice because there was ice everywhere. Jonathan, the hub world is a spaceship uh, shaped like Mario's head. It's great. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is great. Uh, some people don't like the simplicity of the hub world compared to Galaxy One, but I didn't mind it. I started writing a two-hour essay on one character from it. Oh, crazy. Atop the inverted pyramid, how many statues of the sand gallopers are there? Uh, I, I was not paying attention. So, so I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure. Were you paying attention? Yeah. Or do you just have the stuff memorized? I just have the stuff memorized. We have Breath of the Wild, Mr. Cool, and I still... Uh, I haven't played through it, and I'm not a Zelda guy, and I suck at game puzzles, but I've just never gotten to it. I probably should. What's your name? Oh, he, he's, he says that he wishes he didn't play that, and this game was way better. <laughs> this one's funny. What is my name? Mr. I don't think it's uh, Mr. Question Face. I think he's a Sphinx. He's pretty obviously a Sphinx. <laughs> why, did, why did Mario Galaxy suddenly become a game show? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Thank you. Seems like everybody is a different kind of gamer no more in, in the audience here. That's fun. We got a guy that's never, that's hardly ever played Sonic. We've got a guy that's hardly played Yay. 3D Mario because he prefers Sonic. It's a treasure room. So there's not only a bunch of coins, as you can clearly see. It's Odin's treasure room. And then. A moon! No, it's actually a Sphinx's why do treasure you have, ball. Why do you have so much of this memorized? Because I played it. Can I try? Yeah. Well, sure, you can give me five, too. Thanks. <laughs> okay, well, you'll have to help me figure out where to go, because I haven't played this in forever. You need to uh, go to the uh, pyramid. Mm. Where's yeah. pyramid? There. Over there? Yeah. The big upside-down pyramid? Yeah. Look at that. And uh, just wait till you see after uh, the br brutal. Brutals. The brutals are uh, Bowser's henchmen. Oh, I see. So you go inside. Okay, go up the stairs. Mm -hmm. Going up the staircase. Braden, I play games made before I was born. So you probably play a lot of things that I play from you know just after I was born. From the 90s for PC, I see. Sorry, I was reading comments. Okay, I'm gonna play this game now, you guys. Crap. Just ran right into the. <laughs> this pyramid is very fun. It's gonna take a while before we get to those billion coins, Freddy. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Oh, I always forgot how to get out of it. I got it now. 
<laughs> you gonna make it? <laughs> also, the uh, the down things mean that you go down, and the up things mean that you go up. Yep. I remember that part. So, I'm supposed to work tonight, but uh, I'm supposed to start writing my movie script. I just want to play this. You can uh, crouch. Yeah. It's so counterintuitive to press. Oh no! Hey! Crap, crap, crap. It's so counterintuitive to press up to crouch. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna try one more time. Is that right? Yeah. Or are you gonna be upset with me? You can try one more time. What is your favorite uh, outfit in this game, Freddy? Um. Probably the Luigi outfit, easily. Oh, okay. Because when you beat the game, there's this Luigi, and you can play a new game called Balloon World. And then when you have the Luigi suit on, and you want to play Balloon World, uh, Luigi's just confused because there's another him. Oh, that's funny. I didn't know that. And then he notices that it's Mario. Yeah, I love all the customizable stuff and how this game is sort of open world. In a lot of ways, it's kind of a fuller realization of what uh, 64 was after. To take nothing at all away from 64, of course. Job, which ben. is still wonderfully playable, but... And there's a uh, secret moon in the inverted pyramid. It, it's in this part. It's in a hole. Just jump on the Goombas and you get coins. Yeah. I'm just jumping poorly. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> if you just do the two bosses, then you'll probably get the six moves you need. That is so. That is so cool. That it goes from. Can I break this? You need to follow. You need them to follow you because you need somewhere to fly. It is super cool that they go from two D to three D like that. So why are they not following? You? I need to uh, become one and fly. Also, there's a, a secret room behind those pillars. What pillars? Those pillars. They just went. Oh, sorry. Yeah. It's another treasure vault. Okay. I'm missing all these secrets that Freddy knows about. Yeah. I'm ruining it, Freddy. No, oh, it's okay. We won't get every moon, but we will get the uh, six moons that we need. Do I just need to jump over that? Oh no, you can break it. Oh, coins! It's kind of funny that it keeps that sound effect from uh, New Super Mario Brothers. Mm -hmm. Ominous white void. You need that heart. Well, Mr. Cool, I'm just saying, I haven't, I haven't played this in a long time, and it's easy to want to procrastinate when you're starting something. The hardest thing is the blank page, and I'm like, I'm not I'm not sure the approach I'm going to take for beginning this thing. What do you use for it? Yeah. It's kind of hard. Oh, Jonathan, I used to be into Quake quite a bit. I loved Arena on the Dreamcast, which I still have. I know we are in fighting. And Jason likes Quake 4. Me too! Now, have you played that too? Yeah. Hey, I need these coins. Hey, no! No, 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 no. You will not bomb up this inverted pyramid. 
quick fours on Steam. Hey, stop running away. Yeah, Braden, I'm with you, but what I mean is, if they could have made Mario 64 even more expansive than it was back in the day, they would have. But I suppose conceptually, these are still kind of different things, where this is, you know, traversing a lot of different, uh, like, I mean, there's a lot of different kinds of worlds in 64 too, but the idea of you're using the castle as the hub world, and you, you're, you're still in the castle the whole game, versus this, which is, for lack of a better way of putting it, kind of a globetrotting adventure. And... So the multi-moon is just three moons bonded together. And I love how well realized the whole Odyssey idea is. Look how crazy this inverted pyramid gets me tonight. You're an inverted pyramid. So you go oh yeah, Tom, I like the Skeleton Mario too, that's fun. Yeah. And then... It's, look at the, uh, it's been forever since i played this. Look at the... It's a spaceship. No, it's just floating. Oh, it's not a spaceship? Yeah. Also, did you notice that crystal thingy with a uh, multi moon in it? Are you sure it's not a spaceship? Huh? Are you sure it's not because like it's the, pointing the a whole, laser in a desert. The whole alien. Pointing a laser. Yeah, because it looks like a like a spaceship. You sure this isn't like the aliens built the pyramids kind of thing, where instead the pyramids are just spaceships in the first place? Also, uh, look at this. This is crazy. So what? Uh, now there are. Mummies. I don't know if those are skeletons or mummies, but they're deadly. And I hate the boss of this. So if you don't know, you uh, jump on them to kill them. It's really cool. Um, Tony Suarez, that uh, stratification scene in Quake 4 gave me nightmares. Uh, I have not played more than an hour of that. I, Jason grabbed it on Steam at one point and was playing through it. And I finally tried it for a bit and was really enjoying it, but I haven't, I haven't gotten back to it. The big news for me here is that this is all working. Like, without a hitch. We're not having any lag issues. We're not having any frame rate problems. There it is. The inverted pyramids hold. And I get to see this game on my big old Why? It's awesome. Oh, look, a pipe. I'm not going through that. This is ice. Yeah, don't slide off it. Ice and burning. Nick. Which, as we know, is Freddy's favorite part. Because he just wants to watch. You know, some men just want to watch Mario burn. I need to be a Goomba. There's no way I am doing this without being a Goomba. Hey, Freddy, can you hold down the fort if I just run upstairs for a minute or two? Sure. I'm gonna go talk to your mom for a second. Everybody, be nice to Freddy. Like, I'm a Goomba. I'm a Goomba. Where's Goomba? Goomba? Goomba, Goomba? No. Sheesh. Sheesh! Come on. Goomba. Goomba. No. So, I've made contact with the Goombas. 
not burn. So I'll get this moon. Okay, Goombas, I'm gonna have to sacrifice you. <laughs> My favorite, a life of hearts. I'm gonna be fighting. And let's go beat that stupid boss. If you don't know, this boss is actually super annoying. Oh, and I just died. Okay, not gonna fail this time, guys. Those bills are really hard to control. Even for a guy who knows this much knowledge. Fists! I love fists! Senior sticks. I did not take the ring. Hey, hey, hey. I did not do anything. I promise you. I did not do anything. Okay. Punch your face. How are you doing, Freddy? Good. Senior sticks, who's winning? <laughs> uh, Mario, I think. <gasps> okay, I don't know. Tom, is this heat meter better? What the? Or is Ow. 64 is better? Uh, no, I think I like this one better, probably. <gasps> but they're both fine. <laughs> Get him. <laughs> Punch him in the face. Okay, Mario. This is your final chance. Get him! Oh no, here comes my least favorite part of this boss. Hate this. I hate this so much. Oh no! Oh, get out of there! In the words of Commander Krooj, get out of there! Look out, look out, look out! Yeah, there you go. Now he's got it. Punch him. No, stop! No. Punch him, you fist wearing a hat. Come on, punch this ice! Freddy, you sound like you're doing really, really well without me, man. Oh, man. Come on, come on, come on. You got him. Right in the face. I was gonna cry. That time I was trying to get you. <laughs> okay. Do those look like candy to you? Every time I see that, I want I want candy. Oh, look, he, he's he's winded after that fight. Can okay, you guys see this? There's Mighty. Mighty. He's cute. I know. And my favorite, Ray. I don't really like his power because he just glides too much and I can't control him. Oh, I'll, I'll show you what you can do with it, though. He's my favorite. 
Now we just need to go to the Odyssey. Woo! So we're going to save those back for the girls for their birthday, probably. Okay. But, uh... But I want to show you that I got him. Hi, Tom. Thanks for that $5 super chat, man. Put him on the globe. This is a different kind of hand, but it's odd that both 64 and this half hands is the big boss of the pyramid level. Oh, yeah, that's a that's a good call. Globe. Boy, it's just been too long. Okay, so I have to go to the globe. Yeah. It says it needs 16 more. And there they are. You have 17, so... Play that. It's powered up, baby! <laughs> yeah! You should have been saying baby a lot lately. <laughs> because the babies are so cute. Oh, I see. Uh, Cassandra saw herself in a mirror and said, Baby! <laughs> baby! It's really funny. Uh-oh. It's like she didn't even know she was looking at herself. She's like, baby! There's a, a secret in the Wooded Kingdom that makes me never want to look at the Wooded Kingdom again. Which one do you want to go to? I, I'd kind of rather go to Wooded and Lake, I think. Okay. First, but... but don't fall. If you fall, you get to a super scary place that you will never want to see Wooded Kingdom again. Okay, okay, okay. I'll try not to do that. But we all know that I'm not very good at not falling, so... And watch hey, out look, for it's the, the Me Kingdom. <laughs> the Cap Logan King. That right. <laughs> Senior Sticks, if you had Mario hat powers, would you be the most powerful man in Kansas? <laughs> if I could, if I could take my hat and control people, because 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 yeah, you can I actually hat, control people. I I guess I in guess the Metro you technically Kingdom, you would can control a, a person. I don't know a specific person. I don't know if that would make you the most powerful person. It would definitely be a... You'd have to think about the applications and things that you could do that other people could do. You could destroy rabbits with them. Oh, that's that's pretty up there. That's pretty powerful right there. Rabbit killing. <laughs> this is very comfy hat ship we're floating around in. She stopped kissing things. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's enough. One of those guys cool. Yeah. Here's Wooded cute. Kingdom. You can uh, use the uh, cat to uh, destroy the poison. And the piranha plants. Just throw the cap at how the many, piranha plants. How many times are you going to say, uh? You can uh, use the cap to uh, kill the. Uh... That's a shop. How do you know? How, mm -hmm. how do you go in the shop? There's a. No. Close to them. Oh, yeah, I remember this. You can get a life apart, which doubles your health. That'd be good. You should do that. Sure. If you want to live and accidentally fall in the Wood Kingdom, you need that. I do want to live. I want to live! Near Six says Sky Garden. Should we buy anything else, or should we keep going? Uh, you should uh, probably buy a moon. Money. That one? Yeah. A blue moon. Oh, a blue moon. Is it alcoholic? Mm -hmm. Hi, Bright Burns. How are you? <laughs> yeah, thanks, man. Um, do we want to get that outfit? Oh, what outfit? The outfit. Oh, the mechanic outfit? Oh, there's a bunch of outfits, yeah. Sure. If you want. <coughs> Or should we save our money for right now? You should probably save your money because you should you should probably work on getting thousands 
so that you can buy everything. Oh, okay. Is that what you like to do? Yeah. Just wait until you have a lot more. Yeah. And now I'm getting gear coins. Those gear coins are only good in this In this game. kingdom, right? Yeah. Oh, no, it's another Sphinx. Now we you gotta... have the controller, so you have to do the quizzes. <sighs> now it's a game show again. I haven't been paying any attention. I'm reading comments. What does the Bowser monster want from this kingdom? Um, I'm going to assume wood. No, it's not wood. He's laughing at me. I don't know. Because I wasn't paying attention. Lang language. Language. Hi, how's it going? Is it is it water? Maybe. Do you know? Yeah. Well, what is it? Flowers. Oh, it's flowers. Okay. Because he wants a wedding. So he oh, wants I see. Flowers to give. I got you. To the. Uh, I princess. forgot about that whole thing. I haven't played this forever. I totally forgot about the wedding thing. It's all coming back to me now. How do you get up there? You uh. Freddy, we need flood. <laughs> Just leave that poison to me. When you see a crawl on a plant, hit it with your cap. You said that. Oh, did I? Yeah. Have you have you played very much of Sunshine? Yeah. But I got stuck in it. This is some of my favorite music in this game, by the way. That's cool. Do I need to do this? What I'm doing right now? Uh, no, not really. Okay. What should I be doing? You can't go in now. You have to go forward. Oh, okay, forward. Okay. All right, here we go. Uh, I really dig surf rock, like the Ventures in the '60s. Do I look like that? He's eating my hat. <laughs> Get my hat back! <laughs> this game's great, dude. You can only attack the prom plants it's so when great. you have the hat. Like, give me my, my hat back! You just have to ram into them. It's weird how you're just holding it again. There's not even an animation for it coming back to you. Well, there is. If you just is let there? it be consumed. Oh, I see. That's a good word choice there. Consumed. How old are you? Like, 15? Everyone knows that. Hey. Well, I'm I'm complimenting you on your vocabulary. Oh. <laughs> oh. I see. Freddy, we're gonna play another ten minutes or so, man. Okay. Yee. I remember liking this part quite a bit. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Senior Sticks. I'm with you that it kind of sucks that movie doesn't have tip cord. And I didn't mention this in that video I did earlier. I've always liked Time A Fine and the few things that I've read him in and seen him in. Uh, I remember him, I remember liking him fine in Young Justice, but I haven't seen that in forever. And as you can tell, my memory is awesome. That was that was sarcasm. Do you understand sarcasm? No. It was sarcasm. You need that guy. Why do you know everything? I mean, like, I remember these guys, but I just couldn't believe that you remembered where exactly it was, like, it was coming. Well, I use assist mode to, uh, get a lot of things. So, I know where a lot of things are because I sometimes use assist mode. Well, you sure don't seem like you need it anymore. Yep. Because I use assist mode a lot, so I know where everything is. I always spot this There's side. A nut. There's a what? I'm not at the top. I don't know what that means. Mm -hmm. I always thought this guy was really inventive. Really inventive idea. There we go. Boom. And... Nut. With the, like, fine legs. I had to break this nut! This actually kind of feels like something out of Sonic Colors. I play Sonic Colors Ultimate. 
I got Mizzy stuck in it. Ow. Yeah, I bought you that for your birthday when it came out. Yeah. And Jason and I played a little bit of that on camera. But we did have a lag that show and we had a hard time getting very far. This is going to make me want to do more game streaming. Because my technology is finally up to snap it looks like. Yeah. Okay. He's so far so good. Become the piranha plant. Yeah. Is it just that one? No, it's every other one. It's everything. Okay, wait. So what'd you do differently to become the piranha plant? You just uh, control your shit. No, no, that's not what I mean. Like when I when you threw it before he ate it, so you just have to throw it away where he doesn't eat it. Uh, no, you, uh, have to throw a rock at it. Oh. And then... Sorry, I missed it. I was, I was looking at comments and stuff. Um, <laughs> it's like kill a croc. You throw a rock at him. Good job. You do not want First to see First try. The, you do not want to see the horror below. The horror below. If you fall off this grass... Just your word choice, dude. It's it's wonderful. Thanks. The horrors below. Neat. We can use that to get across. What is he, the tick? Neat! There's another nut that you missed. Oh, sorry. Why is the nut important? Because that has a moon in it. Can we go back and get it? Yeah. Well, oh, no. Why not? You can't because the flower disappeared. I suck, it's fine. It's okay. <laughs> we can get the nuts later. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if we need the same path. We need those guys. Freak the blocks. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah! Got you a bunch of coin! Oh boy! A bunch of coin! Look how high <laughs> I went. <laughs> Another draft and nuts! Freddy, this is crazy fun. Thanks. I'm also enjoying it because you know where everything is. I mean, it feels like I've got a walking tutorial sitting next to me, you know, or like, like, a, like a game guide. Yeah. Like a strategy guide. Are you, a, are you a strategy guide, Freddy? I mean, I know where everything is, so I know how to beat the game. Also, you missed a... Uh, game. Where is it? That shadow. See, because he's a strategy guide. There's always uncovered secrets. God, man. He's got it all figured out. Senior Stick says, if the Mario movie, anything like this, I should be fine. Yeah, I mean, it being an Illumination thing, I'm still a little bit concerned about the humor and music and stuff, and I'm hearing some complaints about that in early reviews, but if it's minimal compared to Minions and other stuff they've made, I'll be able to look past it, pass it enough to enjoy it, should I'm sure. I do this brutal? It's Might as well. funny. Yeah, why don't you do this, and then we'll go ahead and call it a night. Okay. Did you have fun, Frank? Yeah. Rawr. Also, what? Uh, stop spinning! Stop spinning! Yeah, I've never loved the designs of these guys. I do. They just don't hey. look like they belong in a Mario game. Do I, look, do I look like I'm a cleanup guy to you? Because, you know, I'm not. No, you're not even wearing a backpack that shoots water. No. At least not today. Sorry, I started to ask you that earlier, Freddy. How much sunshine have you played? 
Um, a Did little bit. It? Because I uh, got stuck in it once. It's hard. Good job. Yeah. Bash him. Bash him. And then you got your cluster. If you go down uh, to uh, where the uh, deep dark is, then uh, you can find many moons, but many scary things. Many moons. But many scary things, so you probably don't want to go there. <laughs> Good job, Freddy. Yay! Cool, okay, you just you just chuck through this. I wonder if you're not too worried about uh, like getting every moon, how fast you could you could play through this game. I could probably try and speedrun it. I would love to see you try to speedrun it at some point. Uh, thing. Is it from a spaceship? No, it's an alien. Oh, it's an alien. Okay. Mm -hmm. Bonk. Well, Freddy. How to bonk you? I'll watch you play for another five minutes, and then we'll go ahead and quit. Okay. Also, uh, these flowers will make me speed run even faster. Whoa, look at that. Ow. <clears throat> what are you going to do now, Freddy? Oh. oh, he's a tank. I remember this. This is fun. Hey. And that's how you get in there. But yeah, this game for me is kind of the best of both worlds between 64 and Galaxy, because the Galaxy was arguably a little bit more linear than this, and I kind of I kind of like that. I feel like there's parts of 64 that, at least for me, were too cryptic, and uh, of course that sounds silly to people because it's classic and everybody knows everything in that game. Besides me, because my memory sucks. But uh, this was kind of a midpoint where it was really intuitive, like Galaxy, but a little bit more open world, like 64. Woo! And you got those coins. Yeah. It's Mario and the Beanstalk. Okay, now, do you have to do the motion control thing? Motion control? Well you're, well, you're doing this. Yeah, so or, that it makes there, me, like, go faster. Or are there, like, buttons that let you do that? Like, is there an option to just use a button? No. Or do you have to do that? I have to do that so that I can get to higher places. I remember this part. This is hilarious. Oh Hi, God, Goombas! Look, look at that Goomba. That's, that's literally what she's called, Goomba. Is that the encyclopedia? Is that what you know that? No. Uh, and she disappears when Mario appears. Because she gets scared. Well, Freddy, we're gonna go ahead and get going now, man. Okay. Because it is about time for you to go to bed. Just a second. Let me just get these uh, coins. And I just need to get a thousand coins and then I'll be done. You need about a billion coins. Okay, so this is the last coin. There we go, a thousand coins. Everybody, thanks a lot for hanging out with us and letting us test my new laptop. This is a success. This is probably going to be my production machine from now on and will allow me to do more cool stuff like this. I love cool, cool, cool. You can, uh... You can shoot the things. Ugh. Okay, we're going to get Bye-bye. Thanks for being here, guys. See you later. Explosion! Also, you can also aim with the controller. Oh, I forgot about that, or didn't know it. Because I don't think, because I think I just played this with the Joy-Cons before. Yeah. Which I'm sure let you do that too, but. Anyway, see you later, folks. Peace out, bye. Bye.